gonna do when you turn four? Is that what you wanted to just be known for shaking your ass on a video? Or doing or this? Or showing your ass? Or doing this? <laughs> and that be disrespecting them. Yeah, it's the name of the game. It's the name of the That's game. The name of the game. Be no. If I ever seen you a video of somebody pouring champagne all over you, I'm gonna be mad. I'm gonna be mad. If I seen you in a video, <laughs> my, my fucking age. <laughs> seen a video of you back in the 60s <laughs> shaking it well, and, somebody, you and, they, and they pour champagne I'm gonna be embarrassed <laughs> and I have been out there shaking my ass guess what you would have really known it and everybody would have never forgot it cause I would have shaken it to my fucking death <laughs> <laughs> oh be all you can be man said I would be all that I could be. So you be right shaking now. yourself in the video? No, if that's what I chose to be. Hell <laughs> oh, yeah. Give it to uh, all. Uh, that's what uh, Superhead be doing. Uh, Just sucking everything. She is a mess. Shut up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you ain't gonna be known for that. Come on. Hey. How you think some people... No, are, no, some no. Some of the richest people in the world was known for that. Mm -hmm. so look at Superhead. Superhead live in Beverly Hills now. Okay, but still... Beverly Hills. I want my mother to be I known I understand that, but she got a son. And they asked uh, her. They said, what is it? The son is for the big dick. What was his name? Ooh, it's a lot of them. It's like, no. <laughs> no. Hey. No. I don't know about a lot of them. <laughs> I'm talking about the one he died. He's dead now. Who? Um, Oh, that he must have been one of the first time, one. Man. I don't he was know. One of the first one. I don't know about that one. <laughs> no, it's what Super Dick. Super Dick. <laughs> super dick. <laughs> That's right. Get out the video. <laughs> Get out of <laughs> here, girl. <laughs> That's right. I'm lined up to make a porno with him. <laughs> Look at her. Get her out of here. <laughs> but you two banned this video. <laughs> but that one here. Bye. Bye. I'm not going to talk to you. Go sit down. Go sit down. I would. Would you want to type it in? Would you want? How would you feel if your mother was known for this? But wait a minute. You said in the sixties. You can't do nothing about that now because you weren't born. Okay, but I would be embarrassed to know. Yeah, I would be embarrassed. That's the past. I don't even want to hear that. But like, oh, what if one of them said like, I met this lady named Barbara. But wait a minute. But if Kim Kardashian, if, if Kim Kardashian and Reggie Bush get married and have kids. She got a porno out with Ray J. I mean, Ray J. Ain't nothing you can do about it. It happened, it happened. That's all. Yeah, I mean, it happened. You got to move on. You can't do nothing about I it. I wouldn't want my mother to be known. We're just thinking of stuff that goes on not in front of the camera. Don't me on the damn pedestal. <laughs> I'm just, you and my don't. mother. Yeah, I wouldn't I'm want your mother. <laughs> and that's about it, too. Back your up. mama. <laughs> you know what I mean? I, my thing is, if I'm your mother, what? And you're going to put me on the pedestal, treat me that way. Mm -hmm. You know, give me a couple of diamonds and rings and hugs and kisses and here's a couple of hundred, mama. She well, tried here's a, here's a Look out, pull that chest out in the window. You know what I mean? <laughs> Stop! <laughs> here's an extra 50, mom. You know? Uh, shit, treat me like I'm the queen. Yeah. You know? Cause it feel like I've always been up there for you. You ought to be, you know. Stop. Stop. <laughs> Shit. If I'm gonna yeah, be out there, like... guess what? I'd be the fuck right out there doing the ass. I ain't Keisha Cole Making in my family, money, but look, look at that money. Making that money. And said, hey, look. <laughs> see, she be from the old one. school. Be a good one. The best that you So if you want to be a hoe, be the best hoe. That's huh? right. That's right. Yeah. You gonna shake oh, your I ass, shake it the best. Oh, That's what I say about Beyonce. I if you gonna shake your ass, you better shake it the best. <laughs> See some damn thing out there looking like something. Mom, do you nasty. like Beyonce? Do who? Do you like Beyonce? I love her. There's nothing wow. wrong with her. I love her for her town. Her town. Okay. That's right. And you don't care about the person. And stuff. the part that she's a young person, uh, but she's gonna burn out young. <laughs> Yeah, she's gonna burn out young. Well, she's 27. She got hinds and too many fives. Oh, shit. You know, she, she's um, like, you know how you get to a uh, stage, you go through different stages in your life. And she's going through too many stages at the same time. 
And a lot of times, the smallest thing, it don't have to be music, it could be a lover, a husband, or somebody to care about something, you know, and it could be anything that'll push her right over the edge and, and she'll never come back to it again. But she has her hands in too many, her irons in too many fires, you know, and she's going to burn out young. So you don't want her to Lauren Hill herself? Hmm? So she shouldn't Lauren Hill herself? Yeah. Because Lauren Hill is crazy. Down. She should slow down, take it easy, nourish that talent that she got for a little bit more, give it a little more milk, give it a little more whatever it takes, and just kind of slow it down a little bit. And what you know, know it from the front, the back, the inside, the out, all over. Then take on something else. But to take on four, five, six, seven things, and you're here, you're there. I know when you're in, a, in entertainment, you got to know how to do a lot of things. But sometimes you got to slow down and take a good look at yourself. You know, it's a, it's a lot of those entertainers you don't hear about now, except for when they want them to do an oldie show mm -hmm. or something like that. They burnt out. <clears throat> you know, it wasn't that they weren't good, because when they was out there, shit, they was the best. Mm -hmm. They burnt out. And so you got to be able to be versatile. If you can't do what if you can't do in music, you do what you can do in films. You know, or if not necessarily films, you got a lot of stars that do little cartoon shows, talk shows and stuff mm -hmm. like that. You hear their voices, you know, or announcing uh, different uh, commercials and things like that. You got to be versatile. But when you're doing a whole lot of dancing and singing and jumping up and down, you hear there and people want this and that from you and they're demanding everybody wants, wants, wants. And nobody's giving you, you burn out. You burn out. She's what? What, 25? 27. All right, she's 27. She probably be burned out by the time she's 35. <clears throat> well, I don't think. <laughs> she's just going to walk off. I don't think. Well, well Beyonce ain't never retiring, so. We don't. She's going to burn out. When you burn out, you burn out. She gonna have some kids by 35, I hope. I hope she has some too. That'll keep her busy. Mm-hmm. That will. That'll make her life worthwhile. That'll keep her busy. But God knows she has entertained people. I mean, you be out there entertained. Mm-hmm. She has entertained people. She's entertained me. I sit and watch her for hours. Who Beyonce? You know, it, yeah, mm -hmm. it just takes me out that one young person has such, such talent inside of them that can... You know, go from one thing to another, and that voice that God gave her, woo, mm -hmm. you know, such, such talent. But she got to slow down. If she want to make it, got to slow down. Well, she already made it. No, you got, I'm talking about lasting. Uh, you want to make it, she's out there now, yeah, but I mean to last. Yeah, people like Sarah Vaughn. No, a lot of them, a lot of them still they last. If you got uh, Patty Javel, Patty's in her what, seventies, sixties. She's in her late sixties. She's got a beautiful voice. She can go out there and still entertain anybody. Mm -hmm. But she had her times when she was up there stomping and stomping and stomping. She ain't doing too much fucking stomping now. <laughs> but you probably get tired of that shit. Mm -hmm. That, that, there's a lot involved in it. And sometimes your, your mind and your body just say, oh, hell with this shit. Mm. You can only have for so much money, and then again, you're not going to spend it all. Somebody else is going to spend it anyway. What's up now? <laughs> so you prepare for that time where you might burn out. You don't know what it might be. Mm -hmm. Well, she's paid. She ain't got to dance no more or we'll sing no more. I loved in that interview. I, I never knew this. I never knew that in that interview when she said, um, until that interview when she said that she could have retired after the Survivor album. Really? She said that Destiny Child, she said they made so much money off the album that she could have retired, but she she does, she only makes albums now because she loves making music. I was shocked when I found it out. I was like, wow. So I, I, I mean, they I don't even sell that many millions, though. Yeah, but you're not, you but have you don't know how money. much, like, we don't know. Like, that, uh, I was shocked, business. too. Like, I was shocked, too. Like, wow, I never knew that. But she said they could have retired after Survivor, but. If you have a voice that don't use it, you should be deep. 
You're absolutely right. You're absolutely right. And I, that's wasting a talent. That's waste, that is wasting a talent. Yeah. What you said? Talent, if you have a voice and you don't you. use it, you should be beat. Uh, it's not just for you. It's for, for the everybody. world. Yep. You're absolutely right. It's to give other people like a song. You might sing a song and might give somebody peace who's so troubled. Mm -hmm. You might turn that's somebody around so with that's a few so words of singing or anything. But you should share it. You should. And it doesn't necessarily have to be for money or fame. Mm. A lot of people like to sing in the shower and see how they sound in the hallways or in a room when they by themselves and they have the most beautiful voice. So maybe I should be a singer even though I can't you sing. Mm -hmm. I could yeah, be a singer. She said it. I could forget it. No, if you went through training. I can't sing. You could. But one thing I can do. If you went through training, yes, you could sing with your voice. But some people are just born. To sing like some people's born with it. He, he has a beautiful voice. I had a beautiful voice at one time. Yeah, but I'm th I mean people like let's say Jennifer Hudson. That voice isn't something the training can give you. No, she, she yeah, she was yeah she she, and she was born singing and acting and playing. Fantasia, that's stuff. another one. Fantasia, oh, no, yeah, that's that, that's, that's, that's annoying Fantasia. thing. You that's just yeah, that's what I'm saying. She was born with, with me. That's nature girl. Yeah. Mm. Fantasia is nature girl. She like to mm -hmm. take her shoes off. Now somebody, now somebody like somebody like Rihanna. <laughs> she wasn't born with that voice. She, she's a voice that disturbing. Oh, shut up. Uh -huh. <laughs> Bye, girl. Mm -hmm. Bye. Hey, Annabelle, Aretha Franklin. They were born with those voices. But but, 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 have a, uh, but Aretha like just can't do it in the code. Okay, she, she just, just can't do it in the code. Warm your pipes up. <laughs> she panicking. <laughs> Warm kick, up, she would have kicked her shoes head. off and hit somebody in the head in that crowd. I wonder if she ever hit somebody with the Oh, she done, she done went in the audience and she done got the shoe back. Patty ain't stupid. What song does she sing? You Order. What song is that? You Order Know. That's know Alanis Morissette. That Alanis Morissette. I don't think I've ever heard that. That's why I said Beyonce did a good job singing that because that that's rock. Yeah. But doing Sarah McLachlan. Bye, girl, fly, girl. Don't do that. No, not bye, girl, fly, girl, but I prefer Sarah over Beyonce singing that. Yeah. Just like a lot of people say they prefer Etta over Beyonce. Okay, That's now would you want song. Rihanna to sing a Beyonce tune? If she could do it. If she could do it, yeah. No, even if she even if she But can. see, no, this is my thing. No, see, this, like, is my thing. Say my this is my thing. This is my thing. But name. see, okay, all right, fine. Look at this. Look at, um, no, no. look at, um, what's the girl's name that Beyonce sung with? Uh, Shakira? The, uh, no, the, 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 the idol over in Europe. Okay, Alexandra Burke. Some people said that they thought that her voice wasn't right for that song. Now, I think the only reason why some people said they thought her voice wasn't right was because of the fact they that they used were so to used be to Beyonce, Beyonce singing. Say, yes. Well, that's the thing. I thought Alexandra did a very good job singing the song. I thought she did a very good job. But, I mean, so many people were just so used to hearing Beyonce singing. I mean, I think you're so used to hearing... Sarah McLaughlin. Yeah, and then when you see the dog commercial, it I makes you want to cry. cry. Yeah, that does make you want to cry, don't it? Yes! <laughs> I will remember. And then we see the. Oh, now that song always makes That's me cry. That's the song Beyonce. No, no, no. Wait, she no. wasn't singing that. No, song. she sang Angel. Angel. And you're I'd be like, oh. But it was cute. No, but it was cute. Your money but it was cute how she ended it with Ave Maria. Like how she brought oh, Ave Maria in there. Yeah, she oh, ended see, it. See, I ain't watched the whole video. See, you. What's they always show you? Sam McLaughlin's part. No, they, well, what videos were you Sam? watching? Well, on so Oh, see, so you had to watch the whole, because she was singing that, mm -hmm. and then as she flowed out of Sarah McLaughlin's, it flowed into the end of Ah Maria. Then she went, By the ah. end. I don't know, but if you hear it, it sounds really good together. I want to really hear nice. Broken Hearted Girl. That's what I want to hear you do, B. I want to hear you do that one. That's my song. This concert, we're going to have fun. Yes. Are we still doing a free ticket? Uh, we might. But they ain't getting no on the floor. How? Oh, no. <laughs> they ain't going on the floor. I'm still trying to figure out. You know, I think the tickets for us, they have to go on sale next month. You know why I'm well, saying that? they got to go before I go to Miami. You know why I'm saying that? It's because <clears throat> I got to find out why I'm coughing like that. When the, B, the, the Experience Tour came, mm -hmm. Me and my friend, we thought they went on sale, I'll never forget this, we thought they went on sale March 21st of 2007, but they didn't go on sale until April. <clears throat> so I'm thinking, her tour, not only will they be going on sale April, then I think the U.S. tour dates will be released probably next month too. 
Because I can't see them waiting all the way until like May or June to release the dates and then put them on they sale. They better do something because I want to go and I want to be like in the front. No, but see, it's confusing now that's confusing to, confusing now. The stage I think I might sit on the damn <laughs> Me, I might get that ticket for you and we sit together on the side cause because how the stage is. The front, they'll be in the middle. No. Uh -uh. And then you'll be like, oh, now, now she's all the way over there. Because I plan on doing something Shit. at this uh, show that I can get her attention. And I think the only way I can do it to get her attention is if I was at that little stage. But I don't want to be at the little stage because she don't want that many songs. she see you there, she's going to have to speak to you. And she can be like, and she, and she don't do, and she don't do single ladies, the church version. Don't tell me she ain't see our, our version. Our version. Okay, don't okay. tell me. <laughs> she, she's seen our version. And for those of you that don't know what we're talking right. about, mm. single ladies, Beyonce did single ladies, the old lady um, who did single ladies a couple months ago when she was in church singing it, Beyonce actually did her version on the tour where she was like, eh, uh, what, what, how are we going again? Eh, 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 eh. Then she was like, now wait, now wait, wait. I was like, oh, Beyonce did that! So, yes, but, uh, is there anything else we got to talk about? I don't know, but I got to I gotta make sure she see me at this show. Because she saw me at the last show. But look, we're going to do a video. Look, all of y'all hit Solange up on Twitter. <laughs> Tell Solange that she needs to pull Mikkel on stage when she comes to Philly. Solange? So, you know Solange on Twitter. How's she going to pull me up on stage? Tell Solange to tell Beyonce. Look, if she get enough twits, she might get over it and be like, all right, motherfuckers. All right, because y'all know how Solange curse. If y'all ain't seen my Solange video, y'all need to watch. This video going to be in two parts, by the way. It is going to be in two parts. Because when my mother, when my mother get on, that's going to be for tomorrow. <laughs> I'm already saying it, so y'all already seen it. But, yeah, so it's going to be a hot tour. Y'all know I'm going. We're going to move. Mikkel's it. going. I'm going to do something. And one of y'all is going. I'm going to do something off the wall where I get Beyonce's attention. For those of you that don't know, when Beyonce came to Philly two years ago, with the Beyonce experience, I did something that no one thought I would do. And I got, and she said something to me. I actually was, um, you want to tell them what I did? Even though you weren't there, but you know what I did. You took your show off. And what I was doing. I was waving it at her. Well, I'm going to do something that's really going to get them to And this is what she said. She said, oh, I see you with your shoe in your hand. Your feet must hurt because I know mine do. That's what she said to me. Don't hate Let me tell you what I'm going to do. Don't. Hey, I'm gonna take my clothes off. Then I'm gonna really get noticed. Ooh, but then we gonna be like, she gonna fall out. Ah, she gonna say, "Hey, ah, that's gonna be my YouTube moment." Okay, can you picture me running around the stadium naked and Beyonce's reaction on YouTube? I don't care if you throw. Well, let me tell y'all something. Ah, no! Let me show y'all. It's going down. It's going down. Now, can you picture me running? Off the stage from seeing me. That would be my YouTube moment. And this Beyonce's reaction alone would be a YouTube moment. She's like, fuck Jay. You going with me. Oh, you showing everything. Let me show something. <laughs> uh-uh, Mikkel. But look, y'all. I thank y'all for watching the Scorpion Show. We'll be back next week. Please stop. You next week, yeah, next week to give you show. But that's if Mikel shows up. If Mikel don't show up, I'll be here next week. I'm gonna do my own videos. I'll be. Here. And then you know they'll be like, oh, the Scorpion show is just not the same without Mikel. Oh. Well, y'all keep doing that because I'm gonna keep doing me. Okay, it's all right. It's all Mikkel right. Have it's his, okay. Mikel have his fans. I have my fans. I don't have but fans. We're better together. And let me give a shout out to Sweet Addictions TV. Because Candy and Skittles, I love y'all. Y'all are sisters. I cannot wait to do a video with y'all. Y'all showed us so much love in that interview with Londa Williams. Oh. And I just love Oh, so did Quadir too. too. Quadir yeah, Quadir too. too. Everybody, oh, I love so Quadir, even though everybody keeps saying all that. Bo no, let me stop talking about what the haters always saying. Because yeah. I know what it is. You know Quadir, you know I got love for you and stuff. You know. You know, sometimes I want to be like Solange and curse y'all the fuck out. I just do. Okay, can I get my shout outs now? Go ahead. I want to give a shout out to my MySpace friend, Kayla. Hey, Kayla, this is your shout out. Is that I'm Kayla like Fierce, the one that took Gavin out the picture? Yes! Oh! <laughs>
that's her. No, yeah, that's her. Oh, um, hey, Kate. Uh, hey, girl, she this is your ugly for saying that. Out. But she did, because when I hit her up on MySpace, when I first found her, I said, hey, wait a minute, you took him out. And she got a little testy with me, too. But we friends now, Kayla. We friends. Get that anyway, who else I want to give a shout out to? I want to give a shout out to, oh, I want to give a shout, shout out to Gavin Loves Beyonce because I haven't heard from him in a while, you know. I want to give a shout out to him, make sure he's still living because you know he's still a Beyonce fan like me. You know us Beyonce fans, we got to stick together no matter what. We got to stick together because we are the only ones. Turn it down! Here. I don't live here. Go upstairs! I don't live here. Um, who was... I also want to give a shout out to T.I. because T.I.'s about to go to jail and you know he's just been he's just been really holding it down with that Road to Redemption I show he and that is my show. show. He's about to go to jail. That's what I just said. He's really been holding it down with that show, that Road to Redemption show. It's a very, really good show. I want to give a shout out to all my haters because you know a hater makes you greater like Scorpion says. I also want to give a shout out to my MySpace page because it is the best Beyonce fan page on MySpace. Hands down. I want to give a uh, shout out to the, oh, I want to give a shout out to Tia. Now, for those of you, Tia is one of Beyonce's trumpet players. I hope it's a trumpet or saxophone. Oh, she hit you up? I hit her up yesterday um, before the tour started. I hit her up earlier in the day yesterday, wishing her good luck. And lo and behold, she wrote me back saying, yes, thank you so much for the love. We're in Canada now uh, getting ready. Um, we're packing this, this and third, but thank you so much. So I want to give a shout out to Tia for hitting me back up, girl. Like, I know how busy y'all is, and you hit me back up. Girl, thank you, okay? Yeah. Uh -uh, I'm not finished yet. I want to give a shout out to Beyonce's band. I want to give a shout out to the Sugar Mamas. I want to give a shout out to Matthew Knows. I want to give a shout out to, to that... Matthew knows. That? Yes. I want to give a shout out to Baby Jules. I want to give a shout out to Nintendo for putting them in that Now, Beyonce knows damn why she don't play the way. And neither do you, because if you did, then you'd be skinny like me. Bitch, I you ain't even skinny. Mm -hmm. But I'm nice Bye, and Bye, girl. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I'm not finished. I want to give a shout out to Tina Knows, because without Tina Knows' creation, there would be no I want to give a shout out to the pregnant Janet Jackson, because she is doing too much to hide it. Yes, with those, Girl. with those parachute clothes. Wait a minute, wait a minute. The supposed to be pregnant, Janet Jackson. Yeah, the supposed to be. Because we don't know. Oh, yeah, I want to get to I don't wear, I want to say, I don't wear congratulations, congratulations to Jermaine and Janet. They're married. According to T.I. According to T.I., he bust the bubble. <laughs> They're married. So, congratulations, Janet and J uh, Jermaine. I guess y'all got married at Neverland. Okay. Um, and February. <laughs> <Nebuary>. February 13th. <laughs> I want to give a shout out to Beyonce because you know Beyonce, me and you go way back. And girl, I'm going to keep giving you a shout out until you come to Philly and until you point me out in the crowd or pull me out on stage. Whatever you got to do. She's going to put me on the screen and it's going to say, hey, and they be like, boo! And she's going to put lover and everybody going to be cheering for you. I could just see you now. It's like, no, How do you think it's going to be when we go to the the they gonna they gonna act like I don't like Beyonce and like I said in my last. No, video. no, I don't. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking oh. about. Do you think when we get there? Do you think people will recognize us? Like, oh, that's McKellen. Oh, oh, do you think that they from the BW board and they big Beyonce fans and they search on YouTube? They don't see. I want to give a shout out to Dre because just Dre is. Oh, look at him grabbing and digging not that his koala stuff. beer. Like he's just look at him. That's the one I was arguing with that day in that video where y'all couldn't see him, but y'all heard me telling him, "Do he want to see me outside?" That's him. Yeah, that's him. That's the one. Okay? Yeah. I want to give a shout out to him because, you know, without him, there would be no scum. <clears throat> Where's Jeremy? Um, they want oh, yeah, and I want to give a shout out to me because without me, there would be no me. And yes, see, this video is totally y'all up for the whole weekend. Yes, it is. Don't email me. Don't. Where's Mikkel? Don't. Where are you? Don't. I'm about to start doing me because I'll be waking up thinking, what the hell am I going to do today to please these people? You know, no! No, it's not what you're going to do to please them. What are you going to do to please yourself? Because you know what I do to please myself? I take that DVD, I take my remote, click, and I go like this. Oh, oh. No, 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 no. It's a joke. Um, I mean, ain't nothing wrong with that if you do. Oh, God, I saw his video where he was saying about... The stuff that he likes to do. I was just like, yes. Ah! Oh, and if y'all think y'all get a video stuff. like that out of me, 
Forget it. Macau, Macau, see, Macau's not as open as me. I can talk about sex with y'all all No, that. I can talk about sex too. Just not on camera. Why not? It's a scorpion show. Because sex I don't need nobody to know what I do behind closed doors. You ain't saying what you do behind closed doors. But you I'm saying what, what I like, like, something that's giving the people the, giving the, that's starting the wheels to turn. Just well, because, like that. Just because, no, I ain't gonna Now, what about that crazy say. man? What about that crazy man who was stalking that little girl from uh, Dancing with the Stars? Bye, saying girl, that he was looking at the man, TV and hoping that he guns. Wait, he said he was looking at the TV and he said by him looking at the TV, he just could see them having kids together. He could tell that she wanted him. Like, what the hell? Well, I can see you and Beyonce having some kids and stuff. You oh, know. please. You know, Mikel don't want that. Beyonce couldn't handle this. Ugh, 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 ugh. Stop it, stop it, stop it. First of all, Mikel would die as soon as he... Soon as... No, as soon as, soon as, as she acknowledge him. him. <laughs> Let me tell you something. When I meet Beyonce, it's going to be... I'm going to make it so fun for her that she's never, ever... Ever going to forget me? Just like she didn't forget that little boy from that Vogue photo shoot. What boy? You didn't see that video when she was taking pictures with the little kids in the Vogue photo shoot? It's, you gotta see that video. It's a cute one. Well, it's this one little boy that stuck out, like he stood out from all the other kids. And she mentioned him in her interview. She was like, "But there was this one little boy, and he was just really." Let me tell you something. His parents better watch out for him. Oh. You know what? He's gonna be. Oh, we was just talking about, wait a minute, we was talking about the to the left video with the little boy that was going, oh my the, god, the, the kick the chair, he was like, <laughs> yes, <laughs> to the left, to the left, everything you own in the box, to the left, oh, my that left, whatever left, then he was spinning he, and oh, rolling, yeah. and he was just like, no, he was like this, he was almost spinning with that chair, <laughs> he was like, oh, uh, what do you think? And to up there and got his tens. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. Thank y'all for watching. We're going to go rate, comment, subscribe.